Are you struggling to attract a specific type of person without any success? Perhaps you're constantly checking your phone, eagerly awaiting a text that never comes. Well, we have a little secret to share. The law of attraction is the key to drawing any type of person into your life. This straightforward theory of attraction has proven effective for countless individuals, including Bob Proctor, who has discussed it well in his seminars. Before we get into it, you should hit that like and subscribe button, and don't forget to share this video with your friends. Clarifying Desired Qualities To get started, find a piece of paper or a card. Take a moment to draw a circle in the center of the page. Inside this circle, you're to write my man or my woman, whichever it is you want to attract. Now you take it and put sort of a starburst on it with a bunch of lines coming up. You should then start to fill in here what you want, the kind of person, the qualities that you want them to have. For the first thing, you want the person to be free, because if they're not, you're not going to be. It's also essential that the person you're attracting is joyful and content. After all, who wants to spend time with someone who's always sad or gloomy? While this might sound silly to some people, it's important to grasp the idea behind it. When we understand the way things work, we realize that we all share the same inner energy. This energy operates according to certain principles, and one of these principles is called vibration. 2. Embracing vibrational harmony. Vibration is the main rule, while attractions come after. Basically, you can only bring things into your life that match your own energy. So, if you're feeling good and positive, you're more likely to attract good and positive things. It's all about being on the same wavelength with what you want to attract. You aim to attract someone who shows kindness and care. This is a warm-hearted individual that can truly enrich your life. Take a moment to reflect on the characteristics you value in others. Someone who demonstrates empathy and generosity often stands out. These qualities not only enhance your daily experiences, but also contribute to fostering deeper connections and meaningful relationships. So here is the thing. When you're doing this, don't go picturing a specific person's face. We get it. You might have someone special in mind, but you can't go messing with their head like that. It's like sending out vibes and images without their consent, and that's not cool. Instead, just put your intentions out into the universe without attaching them to any particular individual. 3. Visualizing Ideal Traits So what's going to go down before we wrap up here? After this, you'll need to go back and keep focusing on the qualities you want your ideal person to have. It's important to envision them being in good health too. So keep that in mind as you go along. You desire a partner who shows vitality and wellness. Someone who exudes energy and zest for life. It's crucial that they prioritize their health and well-being. Additionally, having a sharp appearance is a plus. It reflects their self-care and confidence. Moreover, financial independence is essential for stability and security in a relationship. 4. Living in alignment. Now, remember what we said. You should not imagine a specific person's face because that's not fair to them. You're just messing with their thoughts, and that's not cool. Instead, you should put yourself with all those qualities you're looking for in your ideal partner. It's about focusing on what you want in a relationship, not fixating on a particular individual. If you feel like there's still more you want to include, don't worry. You can always add more lines and fill them in with additional qualities you desire in your ideal partner. Keep brainstorming and adding everything you'd like them to have. Then imagine yourself living and sharing your life with this person in your mind. It's all about creating a clear picture of the kind of relationship you want to manifest. 5. Trust in the timing. This is the toughest step. Letting go. Stop trying to control everything and trust that the universe is bringing together the right energies to make your wishes come true. Release your grip on how things will turn out and trust that everything is happening the way it's meant to. When you start to worry or feel down again, you're sending out negative vibes to the universe. But that doesn't mean you should ignore your feelings. Instead, pay attention to them. If you're feeling sad or anxious, recognize it and give yourself time to feel better. 6. Self-Reflection Cultivating a deep sense of gratitude for the love and connection already present in your life will help you to raise your frequency. If you find yourself attracting things you don't want, it's time for some self-reflection. 
Look inward because you're the only one you have control over. Remember, you can't change others. You can only change yourself. So, focus on aligning your thoughts and actions with what you truly desire. Actually, when you truly grasp how hard it is to change yourself, you won't even think about changing someone else. So, focus on yourself. You should envision yourself with this person in various situations, sharing love, going for walks, having meals together. By doing this, you're aligning yourself with what you want. And guess what? You'll likely find that the right person will just appear in your life. Give it a shot. You might be pleasantly surprised. Alright guys, we've come to the end of this video, and if you enjoyed it, do well to click on the like and subscribe buttons. Don't forget to check other videos on our playlist. We've got some amazing contents for you. See you in our next video.